Do I leave a chat? You don't. You're here forever. Delete chat. No, that didn't leave it. What chat are you trying to leave? I just deleted the, the history. I'm trying to leave the duck cult. I have left the duck cult. In what? Discord or Telegram? I find. Oh. I didn't know. That I was basically the Henry Cavill meme. Discord. Discord and Telegram. I funny. Like, are you kidding? <laughs> God damn it! Why am I still in the duck cult? Part of the ship. Part of the crew, Blake. I'm gonna shit in your mouth. <laughs> <laughs> Stop sending me messages, duck cult. Okay, there is a healing item here. Gimme. Yeah. I don't know what any of these bars and numbers mean at all. You're the music guy, you should know what bars are. <laughs> These bars. Uh, quack. Quack indeed. Unless you're calling me a quack, in which case, uh, fuck you, my medical license was never revoked in the first place. I think he's saying uh, quack because I can't leave the duck cult. You just fool. do what I do and never use the <laughs> chat function ever. You know, I wish I'd thought of that before joining a duck cult. Goo Prime has taught us how to murder things better, a true friend. Yeah. Ooh, it's alive and now it's not. <laughs> we are bound by blood. Don't touch me. Of others, not ours. Yeah. Shotgun big dick. Oh, oh no! It's the moon presence! If you want to see us absolutely yeah. hate each other, go watch XCOM. We fucking unload. Okay. Oh, yeah, pretty much. But that's like, that's not like funny banter. That's like genuine hatred. That is, genu that that is actual hostility. Genuine fucking hatred. <laughs> 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 that is legitimately the most we've argued in a series for a long time. Give me healing. Yeah, we get fucking pissed at each other. Give it's me healing or eat this grenade. <laughs> You know what? You know what? I don't know why I remember this so vividly, but do you remember when we were doing Final Fantasy 15 and Nathan oh! was here for like the first time? Ooh, house key. Yeah. And Nathan was here for like the first time for that series, I think it was. Yeah. And like you guys were fighting over a chair for like 20 minutes straight. Yeah. While we oh. were driving. <laughs> what? Oh yeah. We yeah. Did somebody that. got up. I don't know which one of you it was. Yeah, one of you got up, and the other one took their chair. seat. And then when he came back, the other one was like, "What the yeah, fuck?" Yeah, we just did? were sitting on. Yeah, we both sat on the chair. Yeah. Okay, I got some backtracking to do for 20 minutes. I got some backtracking to do. Hilarious. Oh, uh. I had to watch that all again for the best of. Alright, I need to go back into rooms. Remember like that I'm time I, okay, I guys. ran out of What's gas that? on my car and had House. a chocobo everywhere? Yes, I do remember that. <laughs> House time. I remember that time you walked across the entire map on chocobo, and we played fucking Cards Against Humanity on my phone while you were doing it. I was watching a video earlier about oh my God. Uh, how many Mario games there are. Yeah. This isn't just a roguelike, this is a roguelike Metroidvania. Which is an interesting question because, uh, how do you count it, you know? Yeah. Which Mario games count as real Mario games? And anyway, have Mario in the name. One oh. of the major, uh, one of the major discussion points was whether to count remakes and how much change actually needs to be made to the original game for it to count. What's up now, bitch? And I commented on the video, since we can't Fuck come yeah. to a consensus about how much change constitutes a new game, I think the only rational thing to do is to count every copy of every Mario game as an individual game. Yes. Wow, well, nobody has said anything in Mii Combat since I gave out my mother's phone number earlier. Because <laughs> <laughs> I didn't think you would do it. <laughs> I don't care if you have my mother's phone number. What are you gonna fucking do? I, I don't Call my mother? Sign her up for fucking telemarketers? I don't care. Oh my god. That's it? Yep. Yeah. Cool. All right, well, everybody, if you managed to watch all three of the streams tonight, you've collected all three keys you need to invade my hell. house. To invade hell? Which is my house. I mean, um, and if you're looking to dox me, I'm going to make it real easier, easy for you, because currently I am living in your walls. Justin, you're big into classical. Yeah. Uh, who's your favorite classical artist? I have to say Mozart because he's fun. I do have a hot take on Mozart. If Mozart lived today, he would 100% be a furry. What? That is definitely a hot take. You're gonna have to explain yourself. He was very... I don't know what's the word. It's hard to think. 
because I'm playing a video game and trying sexually to... Sexually deviant Mozart? Some, yeah, uh, not sexually, he's just really fucking out there. What's the worst movie you've ever seen? Worst? Define worst. Uh, just really bad. The Dead Don't Die. Really? Mm -hmm. You had that answer pretty ready. Yeah. Like, the thing is, is it's not, like, a bad movie. It's just a bad movie. Like, it's not bad enough to be good. Yeah. It's just like, it's really not. Sucks. It's not like, uh, what is it, a food fight bad. That yeah. It's so bad it becomes entertaining. It was just, it's the only bad movie I've ever seen, in my opinion. It's the really? only, the only act of, it's the only movie. movie, it's the only movie I've ever seen that I haven't found any degree of enjoyment. There were, like, oh, two man. good jokes. It's got some good actors in it. I know! That's the thing that sucks, there's so many good actors in it. It's just... Yeah. Hang on. Fucking Adam Driver, Adam, Hilda Swinton, yep. Bill Murray. Bill Murray, yep. It's got all Selena these names. Selena Gomez, what the fuck? All these Steve names. Steve Buscemi. And it popped Danny Glover. The whole cast is stars. It actually fucking sucks. The whole cast is stars. It's so boring. There isn't a single B-list actor in this movie. I know. Oh, yeah. The extras are probably played by the fucking... Like, it's so bad, though. Cast of friends. I gotta say... I didn't actually think that a 3D roguelike would actually work. What are you talking about? Risk nope. my brain. I'm gonna go shoot myself now. <laughs> yeah. You do that. There's, there's plenty of roguelikes that are 3D. Nathan! The game Rogue is in 3D. I take back what I said. <laughs> I'm instead going to <laughs> shove a grenade up my ass. Are you a killer? We don't talk. We don't talk about that anime. No, it's like it's like talking about Scooby Doo and then mentioning Scrappy Doo. How fucking dare you, Scrappy Doo? <laughs> Re Scrappy Doo of healer. No. What have I done? <laughs> what have I done? <laughs> Fuck. The entire cast of Scooby Doo. Replacing the. Replacing the. That would have been nice. And who, who's, the one, who get, who's the one who Who's the one who gets fucked? Who's the healer? That's is actually Scrappy good because Doo? During the boss fight, I can use that. Yeah, that's a good idea. What is it? What are you talking about? Who's what the one doing the fucking? Definitely Scrappy Doo. Hey, what is it? Oh, not that still! Woo! Ah! Fuck! You broke my ah! <laughs> uh, Stop locking onto me! Are you gonna read smut? Is that what? Did you do this intentionally to make me read smut? Yes! Do it, pussy! Alright, here we go. I joke and I do a lot of stupid shit on stream. And all the th fucking shit about looking up porn of things. But I really don't want to read Sonic fan fiction. And pick different smut pussy. No, it has to be horrible for you. And also, this is the only one that I know for a fact it's is not, funny. It's not gonna and be like, horrible. There's nothing you're into you can, Sonic? There is nothing you can read me that will disturb me. I really don't want to do this! Then don't do it! <laughs> but I'm gonna call you a pussy if you don't. <laughs> You really want me to read this shit? Either nut up or shut up, please. Jesus nut Christ. up or shut up. Sorry, guys. Yeah, you fucking screamed that right into my ear. Sorry. This is uh, this is genuinely horrible. Dizzy gave me a pizzuri afterwards, and after she finished, we cuddled up and slept through the entire night. Sonic concluded. She seems like a nice and respectable woman with all that power she has from a, from being a gear. Mario commented. She is. After the night of sex, we went to our separate ways, and she took my words to heart for what I told her that day at the hotel. And is she, and is she doing good? And went back to her husband and son? I hope so. But if she did, I wish her the best of luck. Other than that, I hope the family can be a family again. After what has happened. After tip fucking Sonic? Go fuck yourself. Me too. But I'm sure they're back together. You could, do you could be right, my man. I hope everything goes well for Dizzy and the others. 
I don't know who any of these characters are, by the way, except for Mario and Sonic. Yeah, I don't know who Mario is. I don't know who Mario is. Yeah, I don't know who this Who's this Mario guy? He seems yeah. like a dick. Uh, Sounds like one of those broskies you find at rent parties. Yeah, so then after you left with Dizzy, who's next on your list? Good question. This one who looks like a rocker, but is a witch. But she is a witch that controls time. And a very attractive one to be back. A witch who controls time. This <laughs> woman I'm talking about right now is I know. I know? Hold on, you're talking about your ex-girlfriend? No, this is the different one. Oh, I get it. Sorry if I got mixed up. Who the fuck wrote this? This pacing is terrible. I know, I was just gonna say, the fl there is no flow to this whatsoever. It's just hard consonant sound, hard consonant sound. How can you write like this? No one talks like this. No one talks like this. No worries. Anyways, it happened It happened after the day I had if sex any, with I know. I was at downtown around in night, walking through the streets. Page walking break. through the streets. Page break. Flashback. Oh, God. A day passed Thank since you. his time with Dizzy, and the both went to their separate ways. Sonic continued his search for that man, but on the other hand, he decides to get a break from searching for him before he can resume his search on the next following day. With that, the speedster dash around the world, exploring some more new places and unique areas and towns that he hasn't seen before. The blue blur hero even wondered about Dizzy's attacker that day, wondered if she's connected to that man, and maybe this could help him for his search. He needed to locate and stop that man, aka the gear maker. That was all one sentence, by the way. <laughs> Fantastic. I'm collecting all the fucking upgrades for my health. Sonic even didn't ram into any trouble along the way, but he was happy and enjoying his day and not having to worry about dealing with any trouble that come to his way. Sonic spent all day relaxing and traveling and arrived at the downtown by taking a blip to the location and hours later arrived to the destination. The people who <laughs> are friendly with the hedgehogs and welcoming him with open arms. That was one. That was a sentence. Apparently, little did he know that he would meet a certain individual. Who, by the way, that was a certain dot 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 individual. Yeah. Who would want to try harming the hedgehog? <laughs> harming the hedgehog is a great Harming the hedgehog. Oh, of course. As Sonic continued his walk and walk and look around the town, seeing more buildings as it is raining and the crowd is in peace, all of a sudden. Sonic's chaos sense went on alerting him an incoming attack coming at him. The true blue looked over and see a figure holding a guitar and begin playing it. She then summons a green music note shooting it from her hat and it comes straight at him. Sonic dodged the attack and glares at the figure. Turns out it was a woman. She oh has boy. black hair in a bob cut and has red lips and a mole on her right cheek. I know where the red witch hat has a skull face on it. She wears black leather choker around her neck with a gold ring that is connected to a shoulderless red jacket that she can easily take off and put on. It has a red mini skirt and thigh high heel boots with black panties underneath. Her eyes shift color constantly. <laughs> Sharon, I saw you shake your head in disbelief. <laughs> Don't worry, we're getting to the bad part. Sonic and all of this is bad. <laughs> Yeah, but most of it is just bad writing. It's about to get to the part that's legitimately horrible. Alright. Sonic remembered something what Dizzy told her about being attacked by a woman in a red, in red, and carries a guitar. He slowly began to realize what Dizzy told him and found the one responsible for trying to annihilate her. It has to be her. She must be the one that attacked Dizzy the other day, Sonic thought. My, aren't you a cute hedgehog? Are you alone? The woman asked, holding her guitar. I don't know who you are, but are you the one responsible for trying to kill me? Sonic questioned, making the woman smile. What if I am? You're talking about the girl with the wings? Yeah, that's her. Why would you try to kill her? I wasn't trying to kill her, I was just trying to torture her, but she ran away and slipped and slip off from the cliff. I thought she was dead until someone saved her life. Come to think of it, was it you that saved her? Yeah, that's me, but now time to get down to business. Where can I find that man? Do you any connection with him? 
Not anymore. I could care less about him. Speaking of which, I think it's going to be hella fun when I torture you, my handsome hedgehog. You're Sonic the Hedgehog, aren't you? Who's asking? Names I know, the Crimson Mistral. You can call me anything you like, baby. I'm going to call you Beatdown, bitch. <laughs> Sonic curls himself into a ball, and curls himself and struck I know with his homing attack. Then double kick her, kick her a feet away. I know hits the ground, but got back up. Then shoot a green music note from her hat as it hurls itself directly at Sonic, blocking off the technique. I know flies over to Sonic and smacks him with her guitar a few times, then shoots a shockwave of magic from her hat, sending Sonic back down to the ground. Sonic did a starfish tip up to get back up into the play. And I know walks towards Sonic with his car, smiling specifically at the head dog. Sonic throws himself up into a ball and shot wave of blue energy over at the Crimson Minstrel. Sonic Storm, I know of Aether, giving Sonic a chance to death ahead to the Can we skip this fight? Yeah, sure. This is boring. I'll try if I'm bored. Speaking of bored, I never noticed how strong you are, Sonic. Don't try to play any mind games with me, babe. There's no way I'm not falling. <laughs> There's no way I'm not falling for it! Uh. <laughs> Why so angry? Just relax, baby. I hate that they keep using that word. Are you ready, Nathan? Yep, do it. Okay, uh, so some stuff happens. Sorry, my there hands. Is no, yeah, 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 I, I get you. I'm just gonna, just gonna. Uh, <laughs> oh, apparently I skipped right as it was getting to the horrible part. Okay. Uh, are you done? Or are you gonna keep going? Like, what the I'm going to the end of this like segment because this is like fucking 20 pages. I'm not reading 20 pages of this. But I do want to get to how horrible it gets, because it is funny. Alright, uh, what do you mean? What I mean is instead of showing me how well you can fight, I wonder what you can do in... I know leans in closer to whisper in Sonic Gear. In other areas that you can do. And don't continue. Before Sonic would respond, this results in by a kiss from I know catching him off guard. She lifts herself away from the wall and wraps her arms around the hedgehog and shares an intimate kiss with the hedgehog. Shares an intimate kiss with the hedgehog is not something that's not Still shocked of this, Sonic wonder what is going on and I know run down her hand over Sonic's crotch and rubs it, showing Sonic a little bit of her freaky side. This is genuinely horrible! Yes! <laughs> the kiss didn't last for long, for only two minutes, and Sonic pulls away from I know. What the heck was that for? Two minutes! Two minutes! <laughs> <laughs> two straight minutes! It didn't last for long, and then he pulls away. What was that for? Two minutes! You're caught up on this whole two minutes thing. Because it's weird! Fuck you, yellow beard. Because two minutes is not a short amount of time! Like, for for some things, yes, but not for kissing when you didn't consent to it. And then ask what it was for. That's weird! You're Sorry. Weird. You're weird. Not this weird. You're the one reading this shit! Beyond me. I'm reading this because Nathan made me. I'm not making you do anything. <laughs> You have chosen this path before you. You said you would call me a pussy if I didn't do it, and now Correct. I'm doing it. So, you made me do this. <laughs> and now that we're starting, we're not stopping until we see the depths that this hole reaches. Don't take that weirdly. <laughs> I will take it however I fucking want to. What do you think? I'm willing to show you a good time with a woman like myself for the night. Uh... I, I, There's I, a scene change coming up, and I'm stopping at the scene change. I, I'm just glad Trinity's not here to listen to this shit. <laughs> well, I got to admit, I did enjoy the kiss. Maybe this would be my chance to release some of my frustrations out on you instead of fighting. Out in you. No, no, I read it right. <laughs> I'm, yeah, okay, fine. Okay. Catching on what I'm offering to you, but good besides I've been looking for a good fuck for a while. And you weren't my perfect choice. Is this 
I don't say oh, blame fuck. Come on, let's get out of here and get us a hotel for the night. Okay, then there's a bunch of... No, it gets weird again. Sonic nodded, and I know Ben's only got her car to her amusement. She even showcases her glorious ass towards Sonic and show her... Okay, yeah, that's... Her glorious ass. <laughs> it says that. Um... Okay, I can't bear to keep reading this. I'm going to read the absolute worst part that I found, and then I'm done. Alright. This made I know so eager, craving for the blue blur's pleasure and his cock by just <laughs> staring at his bulge. Oh my god. Um. Uh, yeah, then there's some weird stuff. These fingers are. And then the the scene ends with him saying, "I'm going to fuck the shit out of this woman." She doesn't even know what she's getting herself into. Sonic thought. I'm done. I only have so much fucking patience, my dude. I... You only have so much patience? Yeah. yeah. What was that shit you were reading about cicadas earlier, by the way? It was the uh, cicada killer wasp. What the fuck is a cicada killer wasp? And why did you have to read about it suddenly? Because a friend of mine apparently found one in her backyard and killed it, and was like, Guys, what the fuck is this? So, he approaches the rotary, okay, and he's taking it at 50 miles per hour because he thinks that it's, go it's a on ramp to the highway. And he fucking doesn't have time to stop or slow down or any of that shit. And so, he takes the rotary. You know how that's like, you know, whatever. And he hits that shit. Going 50, jumps that shit, and lands in the middle of the that patch of grass, that rotary, and he just keeps going straight on through it. And he gets off the other side, and he's like, "Woo! I'm alive!" And then the red, white, and blue like blares up, and he's like, "Oh man, <laughs> how did he not die?" Yeah, and the cop like pulls up, and he's like. He gets off of his bike and his legs are shaking and the cop gets out, walks up to him and he's like, I have no idea how you survived that. I saw the whole thing. I was ready to call an ambulance and a tow truck. License and registration, please. I was, I was calling from like the fucking call. Dude, he means yeah. where it's like, how the fuck did he not die? I have no idea. And so he's fucking alive. And the cop lets him off with a warning. Oh my god. He doesn't get arrested. He doesn't get a ticket. He gets a warning. Motherfucker maxed out his luck sack. No! Was this porn? Fuck you, Justin. This is getting sent to me, Jonga. <laughs> no! Fuck you. <laughs> you hey. made me see this. If anyone asks, where did you get that? Why isn't there a fucking iFunny logo, you know why. <laughs> is that even a character? Is that, is that it? Is that Invincible Squirrel Girl? What the fuck is going on here? What the actual fuck is going on here? I don't know. But that's what I got when I typed in Squirrel Orb. I mean, it's vaguely orb shaped. It is orb shaped, but not because I wanted it to be. <laughs> Uh, it's I'm, inflation, Jaren, in case you were wondering. Okay. I haven't gone... Not economic, not the economic <laughs> guy. <laughs> Don't believe him, look up Fudinari inflation. <laughs> you ever see that one movie where the guy gets turned into the dog? No. I don't remember who it was. It was some actor who, like, you would expect to get turned into a dog in a movie. It's like a really shaggy dog. I think I know what movie you're talking about. I think it might be T Tim the Toolman Taylor. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm glad I'm not crazy. Honestly, I know this isn't the most, but it's the first one that came to mind for me as my hero. That's fair. Like, it's a good show. Yeah, it's a decent show. Like, it has its 
tropes, like, you know. Oh, yeah. It does. Fucking flashbacks every two seconds. It's literally... That is very... That is very, uh... Uh, what's the word? Apt? No. That is a fair criticism, just... Oh, yeah, definitely. Season 5, I counted. 25 seconds before the first flashback. <laughs> Amazing. Oh, really? I have to climb all the way back. You think back it's only going to get worse and worse as they have more to flash back to? Yeah. The thing I hate the most is when they flash back to something that happened in the episode, especially when it was the previous scene. <laughs> <laughs> like, come on, man. When did that happen? Because that's hilarious. Oh, my God. It has happened at least twice. I couldn't give you the exact one. One of them was in season 25. Or 25. Season, season 25. 25. Yeah. Please write in the comments the date and time at which you watched this and lost the game. Your mother's maiden name, your social security number, and the name of your first pet. And if you're a mother, the name of the child who you love the most. Jaren, if you could only say the word skadoodle for the rest of your life, what would you do? Skadoodle, skadoodle. Nathan, squirrels possess the necessary skills to kill you. <laughs> Why can't Nathan be gay? Because he's too addicted to Gardevoir hentai? No, because... Because if he gets nut on his face, he'll die. Yeah. I was... Nice. I was working there, and... <laughs> fucking, you, you delivered the fudge line a little too soon. <laughs> well, it was my joke. I know. <laughs> Sorry, Nathan. <laughs> I, I knew what the answer was immediately. <laughs> Yeah, I had to say it before you did. <laughs> Look at that, buddy. You can get back up here. Oh, here. our amount of likes went down again. <laughs> oh. Okay. TV static. Um, okay. Uh, ah! Alright, uh... Uh, okay! It's really fucking quality. Yeah, it's actually pretty fucking freaky. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's... That's writing a hilarious line between scary and stupid. <laughs> that is genuinely comical. Yeah. Here's my review. This was a fantastic game, until I got to the boss that asked me for a real-life file on my computer. It told me the power would be based on how old it was, so I, thinking I was clever, chose a system file, knowing it was the oldest thing on my computer. Then the game told me that if I lose the card, it will delete the file. The game is now ransomware, and I'm afraid to play it. <laughs> I chose a goddamn system file. I can't believe the game did that shit to me. I was like, hang on, I have the what oldest the file known to man. And it was like, you have Uno dipshit. There's a quote that's popular among aficionados. A jizz band without a fifth has its work cut out for them. A jizz band without a clue horn should find a new gig. Jizz was an upbeat swinging genre of music, most notably performed by Figrin Dan and the modal nodes and the max rebo band other notable jizz bands include Bobolo baker's all fit band um <laughs> what's that i don't know i kind of want to walk around anyway hey network error all right guess we're done oh, okay i started playing which buttons the okay never mind <laughs> oh god damn it I started- Oh my god, stop! No. I st- Oh my god, stop! What the fuck is going on? There's like a billion fucking enemies all of a sudden. What the <laughs> fuck? Like, I know I'm bad at this game, but there's definitely more enemies <laughs> for me, right? Yeah, yeah, no, no, you're not crazy. Here you go, take it back. <laughs> well, 
<laughs> I don't like you either, game. <laughs> oh my god, wow. the game said, oh, play, bet. <laughs> this was some dude, and there's apparently more. Yeah, the article even fucking says that they were named after a rumor, which means he may or may not even be a cleric. Hey man, that thing looks like a cleric beast. Why? Because I said so. Shut that thing up. looks like the battle pass. I don't get why that joke ever started. Me neither. But what you said didn't make a whole lot of sense either, so I just... Yeah, well, at least my thing was relevant. <laughs> my thing was relevant because it's fit the same format as the thing you said. Yeah, but I'm objectively right and you're objectively wrong. You're right about that. No. The read button is blasphemy. I must read from the page. Okay. Uh, go ahead. In the days of the old gods and goddesses and demigods and demigoddesses. <laughs> and and then it was... Okay, so that must have been starting mid-sentence. And then it was a very good night throughout the yes, it was beautiful when they so select few decided to have a wonderful picnic of ambrosia and before it went extinct forever they finally noticed they had crossed a they had crossed a but it was happy moment can you okay bring up the read thing again this is I, that's i was reading it verbatim i swear okay good there it's proof i'm not fucking insane that's exactly what it's saying no. oh no he's just gonna get you Yeah, I gotta be honest with you, Chief. I got no idea what the fuck's going on anymore in this game. I don't know either. I go through cycles of thinking what I thinking I know what's going on, and then immediately being like, nope, I have no idea what's going on. My work had a uh, holiday event today. Nothing big, just like we had an ugly sweater contest. I didn't have a sweater. Okay. But they also had like. You had a, the ugly though. What? You had the ugly down. Damn. They also had like a guess that song thing, and I won that. What was the song? Nice. It wasn't one song, Justin. It was like how whoever, whoever could guess the most. What was the song? <laughs> Number one on this list is called the Gem Blade. Locked away after it nearly crashed the economy, this plus two <laughs> nearly crashed the economy. <laughs> yes. <laughs> This plus two longsword turns whomever it, wh whomever it slays into a pile of coin. My superpower is the ability to erase anyone's memory from the last ten seconds. However, it has to give them the memory of the most real of the person before them whose ten seconds got erased. Oh, All that's right. Cool. I like that. I like that one. Like, what you find in the hole is the hole. Why am I looking at holes? A worn teddy bear. A warm? A worn. Warm teddy bear, recently used. <laughs> Justin! Well, hello, welcome to Cyberpunk. Would you like the cyber or the punk? As soon as you turn down the hallway, you step on... I should have checked for traps. You step onto a platform that kind of sinks in, and then you... Uh-oh. One of your party members starts to fall. I... Try and catch them. Where are they falling to? What the fuck's going on? Um, which one is it, by the way? <laughs> cum. <laughs> <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> the cum may fall. Okay. As soon as, as soon as you see, you hear it, you see cum just fall down onto fifteen spikes. <laughs> Ouch. Damn. Cum is dead. Instantly killing. Somebody him. play the crab rave. Hey, this is like that one time we played Pictionary because we were bored and- He died how he lived. Fast. <laughs> he died how he lived. Get okay, uh, Impaled on a spike and dripping liquid. You head on straight for 35 feet. Then you turn to a right. Turn, turn right? You're turning right. I want to go that way. Sorry, I- Can okay. okay. anything? <laughs> I look at my compatriots and I say, farewell, friends. <laughs> <laughs> so you step forward? Yeah, I'm stepping forward. Oh, I right. know it's a trap, but the fact that you're g goading me to check for traps 
<laughs> means that I, I've already failed. It's time for me to die. <laughs> okay, so as you step up, like five feet forward, your foot hits a wire. <laughs> and uh, you hear this whooshing sound as a net comes swirling around you. A net. Uh, disabling you. I don't even know her. Or more restrained. You're basically just restrained on the ground. Okay. It's not a deadly trap. That's fine. Hello? Uh, Shit? Piss? Can someone help me? Ejaculate? You open up the door, and as you walk in, you see a giant vulture and three bandits. Oh! I yell to the vulture, hey, fuck these guys, right? <laughs> and try to convince the vulture to fight the bandits. Here we go! All right, we'll continue this later. <laughs> we'll be right back. And we're back. And his liver has been eaten by the vulture. What's your favorite fire emblem? Go. I don't... I don't know any Fire Emblem. Well, what's your favorite one? You gotta pick one. I don't know any! Pick one, Jaren! I don't We're fucking know! Name the Fire Emblem! <laughs> And now that I've told you about it, I have cursed you. I don't give a shit. Because now you are no you no longer have plausible deniability if it becomes real in the future. I'll just feel like shit dude, I just forgot. <laughs> I think it would I think an AI obsessed with uh fucking efficiency would not accept that as an uh, unacceptable response. <laughs> Your honor, would you accept oopsie daisies? <laughs> remove to remove all charges. <laughs> Your Honor, my client pleads. Oops, I forgot. <laughs> eggs in Spanish is spelled with an H. Were well, you trying to spell eggs? I don't know. I'm trying to. Whatever Peruvian huevos are. Peruvian huevos. Because fucking Minecraft. I'm just gonna leave it at that because it sounds like I'm completely schizophrenic right now. <laughs> yeah, that's exactly what you That is how it sounds. <laughs> yes, there's always another run, but I really want to beat it on this one. <laughs> there's not another run. Tyler. Not tonight. It's over. This is the end. He beats it or he dies. I execute him right here and now. That was labeled Fatal Crash. Oh, car crash. That's what I have thought. It's never been about this space bullshit, has it? Well, if we remember correctly, uh, one, one of the story moments in the house, there was the news that was talking about an accident. I think I know what's going on, but let's just... Yeah, I knew about the car crash thing. I just didn't really know how it factored in. This is a bad time, Nightbot. Nightbot, please have finished before. I will jab a metal rod up your anus if you say anything additional. several times. Yes. But not for the Here's whole thing. Here's the car crash. Yep. We've seen the trees before, but never actually saw what it was. Yep. Oh, shit. Yeah. That's what I thought.
shadows. seeing that in loading screens. Well, also, why we keep seeing the water is because of that red, the big cracking kind of look Cthulhu monster thing at the end, too. Is that it? 